welcome back to Dark Lord Kaiser playing through the Talos Principle. This area is entirely done. I probably should have started this record. <laughs> back in the big room. Rejoice, child. You rejoice. For oh, you have wait. fulfilled all your tasks in this land. You Except have for them. conquered all its guardians and Except solved them. all its mysteries. Except for them. Thus, you are appointed its master. I was already its master. I am Dark Lord fucking Kaiser. I'm sorry, that was unnecessarily aggressive of me. <laughs> really do with it as I will. There's nothing to do aside from that, as we've said. It's not like I can't go gardening or anything. Alrighty, Ruth. Right. Off to the land of sand and pointy towers. Also known as pyramids. Record didn't seem happy there for a minute. Whatever. So, what can I do? Can't go up the Tower of Death. Well, I can go up the Tower of Death, but I can't get anywhere past the first level because I haven't unlocked all two yet. Okay, into. Here we go. Oh, yeah, is this where uh, Sheep left his suicide note? No, that's not Sheep. Hmm. I guess we'll come across him. I forgot to check that um, computer by the beach. Forget about it. You check. Let's go back. I'll go back, and if it's not worth the effort, then I'll just cut this bit out of the record. <laughs> Wasted my bloody time. Welcome back, viewers. It was still the blue screen of death. It was a complete sodding waste of time. Oh well, didn't really matter. For once, it's not your time I'm wasting. Oh, Jesus, that was some slowdown. What the hell happened there? Oh well, doesn't matter. Look at a ladder for a second there. Oh. How deep underground are these bloody things? Question. If this is that far down, because that was a pretty long elevator ride, why can I see the sky? Or more accurately, when I'm wandering around on the surface, why can't I see in here? I'd say I found a plot hole, but I haven't. It's a virtual reality world, the laws or whatever the hell the uh, design decide they are. Oh, it's you. Did I read this? Oh yeah, I read that one. Hey, and I wrote that one. Uh, I, yeah, I think I may have read the, wrote this one in my in-between sessions. I think I found a paint pot there and put it there. There's certainly somewhere a um, QR code that I wrote in between uh, the sessions for basically no reason other than to amuse myself. But I can't remember whether it was that one or another one. Alright, let's go this way. What do you say? Floating box, which I don't think is a oh, clue with me. The tools to overcome this place. Oh. So there's. There's a message I wrote, apparently. Window through a door. Oh. Well, at least I can see where I need to go. Red laser. There's. There's a QR code. So I need to remember to get to read that when I get to there. That's a buzz buzz. There's another. Ah, there's another one. 
Okay, so let's assume that the problem is going to require a laser somewhere down there. Okie dokie, so what we got here? I just don't understand this one. I figured I'd try and make some progress here, but honestly, it's such a thankless task compared to what else is out there. The map card. Here. Oh, that's a slow charger. Yes, that's why it's called Window Through a Door. Okay. Right, right, right. So, if I take this and I select that and place this. Where is he interesting? Here. Okay, so what I need to do is have this open and Okay. If I take this, make that, that, put it there. There we are. I'll freeze this up. Which freeze? Piss up. So that's why that one's such a slow time, because you can't just use the uh, timing puzzle before, you've got to bypass the puzzle. Okay, now we go up. I'm not sure why you felt the need to put this up a ladder when you could have just put it behind the gate. Curious. I was wondering if I needed to put a thing up there, but it occurs to me I wouldn't be able to climb the ladder if I was holding something, so I guess it's just an artistic design? Eh, who knows. Right. Let's see, where to next? Do 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 do, 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 do. This way. Over the fence. I swear we've had one called over the fence already. Huh. I. I guess it's a tutorial saying you can do that. I said earlier that, uh. That there was a puzzle at some point that uh, expected you to do to put a box on top of a box on top of a um, an explodey friend, and it never told that you could do that. So I I wonder if that's in one of the other. I guess that was being a later bit, and you just have the option of getting to that puzzle before you've got to this one, which is a bit of a. Bit of a poor design. If I go into this one over here, where would it get? I th have a feeling this is the uh, the one. So I get the feeling I need to use the, yeah, I think I need to use this to get that box to the far end so I can't traverse it. Jam it over there, yeah. So it's possible to come and try and do this puzzle before you've done that one. 
and thus not know that you can put a box on top of that uh, that bomb's head. But of course, once you know you can do that, the puzzle's fairly trivial. But yeah, the fact that uh, you can do the puzzle before you've done the tutorial telling you that's even an option is a ever so slight design flaw. Just a little one. Hey, a screamy guy! Oh. In the time of your ancestors, there were those who did not choose the path of faith. You do not need to fear their ghosts. Fear only that you may become like them. Is that a warning? Are you threatening me there? So... The thing was, I came out of there and sort of heard the, uh, the sound effect of screaming. I'm just going, that's strange, that sounds like something screaming. And then all of a sudden saw the uh, the ghost sprinting straight for me. I was like, oh, that uh, wasn't quite what I expected to happen. And then Elohim destroyed him before I got to have a conversation. Then again, if it was a ghost, then I guess it wouldn't have been much of a conversation. It would have been, ah, uh, hello, how are you doing? Ah, uh, that's, that's uh, nice. Something about a star. Something. Oh! <laughs> so there's a star here. Just to annoy you with the fact that you can't get it. Well, I'm guessing this is like the previous one. It's somewhere right the way over there. I can fire a red laser. I don't know. Let's, uh. Let's not worry about that for now. How long do you need? Quite a long time, as it happens. Quite give me enough time to do that. This, uh, me getting a buzz buzz slow it down? No. No, it doesn't. Okay. So, if this has got something to do with. Let's have a, a good look around the area first. So obvious solution is go directly opposite it. Let me see if there's any red lasers I can find around here. Window through a door. Oh, that could be the uh, the hint about where. So let's. So I can come back to here. And set myself up. Set myself up. Oh, maybe I can't set myself up. Well, let's, uh... Give myself something to aim, aim at, I suppose. If that is the limit of the reach of those things, I don't know. 
No, I didn't uh, have it lined up properly. Mm. So, there's my red laser. Select. Select. So now I can go in here. Doesn't really help me with this puzzle, though. I thought that maybe that uh, in here would be something else I could use. Hmm. things bouncing. I don't think I can put one of it here like that, do you? Legitimately is just getting exactly the right timing. Yeah. Okay, it was just a a wait for it puzzle. Well, I feel like an idiot for struggling with that for so long. I think I had the solution at one point then. I just didn't have exactly the right lineup for it to work. Oh well. Whatever. Victory from the Dark Lord. Any more puzzles in here? No? Any more screamy men? Or women? Or robots? I don't even know what the terminology to use. Sounds like a man's voice to me, but that doesn't necessarily mean much. Right, well, I guess that'll do for uh, an episode then. Um, pretty much, I think I've done everything. I'll double check I've done everything in this area. Secret star, all the things. Yeah, we're done here. No more beep booping computer, so, uh, yeah. Bye.